Antonine. And look at Lisa in all of her curvaceous glory. Oh, heavens, it appears that my wee-wee has been stricken with rigor mortis. Good morning. Peter, what on earth are you wearing? It's a dashiki. And don't call me Peter. That's my slave name. From now on, call me Kichwa Tembo. Cool. And hey, I'll be Mambutu O'Malley. Peter. Kichwa. Uh, I'd like to have a word with you. Peter, I think... Kichwa! <sighs> Kichwa, we're both sensible men. There must be something I can do to make things right with you. Actually, there is. I want reparations, just like Cleveland got. What the hell are you talking about? I want an apology and some Rice Krispie treats. Well, I absolutely will not give you an apology, and I'm assuming Rice Krispie treats is black slang for money, so here's $10,000. And I expect you never to mention this ugly business again. $10,000? Not enough? Fine, make it twenty. How do you spell Kichwa? Yeah, you know what? Screw the Kichwa. Make it out to Peter, P-E-T-E. -E. This just in, slave owner descendant Carter Pewterschmidt has paid $20,000, or two million pennies, in reparations to a local black man. We now go live to the local black man. Well, the money helps, but I'll always feel my ancestors' pain. <laughs> hey, hey, from down here, does it look like I'm talking into a bunch of robot penises? Hey, Lois, come in here and see what I did with the money your dad gave me. Oh, my God. You turned the den in 